Howdy folks, this is uh, the band of 0073 here, we're burning that rub across the land, cruising on into that car park with a handbrake. Now today I'm bringing you a retro video. I'm doing a um, quick guide to the secret vehicle locations in The Simpsons Hit and Run way back on the old PlayStation 2 console. Now, the quick run through the controls, the right analog stick basically does your um, camera. Triangle gets you into a vehicle, which I'll show in a second. Circle is your dash. Left analog stick obviously makes you run. X is jump. Square is your attack. X try and double X double jump. And yeah, double X square double jump attack. Now, as I was saying. Try and get you in the car. Now, let's roll, as Homer would say. As Homer just said. I'll shortcut to these locations, too. So, first one for level one. Which is the rocket car. <clears throat> I've covered these in another video before, but that was just saying where they were. Now, this is showing you. And so, I'm shortcutting. So, you, fall, you go from Evergreen Terrace. Basically, follow the road around there, or you can shortcut it as I did. I'll do another video on the actual short, proper shortcuts in the level for race for the races and that. But for the time being, we'll do I'll deal with this. And just keep following the road around, shortcutting if you wish. It's up to you how how perfect you drive. Learn to drive, dumbass. Another one of his quotes. Now jump over this bridge as I as I discussed in the video. Now I'm gonna shortcut over the top of this gasoline building, but. You don't have to if you don't want to. You follow the road right left here. <clears throat> and here is the rocket car. Now there is another shortcut. Oh, another way to it. I'll just drive I'll drive to it rather than drive right back around. For most of these there is actually more than one shortcut. Or oh, well, path. The other path I dictated was to the stone cutter's hidden tunnel. Which comes at the back of Mr. Burns' mansion. Which, which, if you follow Evergreen Terrace the other way, all the way around, will bring you to this tunnel, which actually flows through the nuclear power plant as well. Now I'm going to shock it here if I time it right. Just. That's a shortcut that requires a lot of timing, folks. Now we go from here. As I say, just follow the path. I'm doing the reverse, so you do the reverse of what I do here. Whoa! Wrong button! Too used to playing track, ma track mania with L2 and R2 being accelerate and break. Haven't played PS2 in a while. Anyway. Shortcut through the field. Again, if you want. If you don't want to, you don't have to. But there is a car location here in a later level. Which is actually just in the Royal King Trailer Park here, which I'll get to shortly. And of course, this leads back to the main road. Let's get back around. Learn to drive, dumbass! You really want to do it, Homer? Be my guest. Anyway, so from here, basically just follow the road around, which winds you back back to our starting location, which I'll... Whoa! I was, got a little bit too slow there. Let's say just wind you back around. Uh, so just basically lead you back around to the starting locale, which is Simpsons house now That's level one the rocket car now I'll go to level two now Oh, yeah, so each level actually has a, um, a Special little Springfield shopper reverse thing that comes up on the loading screen As you can see this is the one for level two I'll show you the one for level 1 at the end of the video. I should have done it before, but I'll do it at the end. Yeah. I'm actually not too far from the car for this part. I will do a video showcasing the actual cars that I'm getting to and the drivers for, for specific levels. But that's another video. I follow the from here, or from this, where you start the level. Do a quite literal U-turn. 
and follow the road back past Springfield Stadium. Try not to hit the bloody drives because they will fucking move in your row, the bastards. Laws of physics. Lousy laws of physics indeed, Bart. Ah, god damn it, vehicles. Okay. I'll just go down here and hand brakey. Okay, here we are. The monorail station. Lousy laws of physics. So basically, so you can actually count down, count down the Matlock Expressway if you really want to from the way from the other side of the level, but that's your own. I will show you, but basically from this section you got the, the big monument there in the middle of the roundabout, and I find the Krusty Burger. And the Googleplex Theater just there I've just passed, which I'll spin around. See? Springfield Googleplex Theaters. So if you want to go, you go to the left from here, past the news place, whatever the heck that's for. So basically, I'll, I'll just park on the full pass so keep the vehicles flowing, drop the vehicle off there. And your actual vehicle you were driving, folks, it actually doesn't disappear unless you happen to use the exploding car sheet and make a go-car blammy. And then you've actually got to repair it in a phone booth, which I'll better show you those too, which is actually just below here. Um, anyway, run up those stairs from where you park your car. And double jump across this gap. And as you see there, the flashing triangle. Bada bing, bada boom. That's your monorail car. Level 2 secret vehicle. If I jump back down, the phone booth, I'll just dash to it. These things with the floating, floating spinning phone here, folks. Or indeed your phone booth. Oh, and might I add, you can actually plug any car, any car that's driving around on the roads, too. It's awesome. Okay, so that's level 2. Level 3. Now, I personally have favorite levels, but hey, that's just me. For, that's my experience from playing the game, so. I think I'll leave, I'm going to leave that one in your own court, folks. Because you're, you all have your own favorite level, as we all do. Well, if you ask me, folks, everyone has their own opinion. It might be biased, but... Oh, well. Anyway, level 3. We are playing as Lisa. As you saw, Homer and Bart, and I've already got, and I've got them outfitted, by the way. This is not their regulatory outfit, and I'll do a video on those, too. I'm going to start a new game, and I'll basically run you through unlocking every, basically unlocking everything in the game. One of the hardest missions is actually a bonus mission, which is level 7, the final level. And I'll, and I will do a video on the shortcuts as well. So, anyway. This is a handy one for a race, too, by the way, because it cuts out that big corner down, that's just down the block. So, anyway, there are a couple of little bastard missions. You jump across there. I will duck back to level two a bit later on. But, actually, I'll do it in... That wasn't supposed to happen. I'll do that other shortcut in level six, because it's the identical level. I'm oh, sorry, level five, rather. Where did I level six from? This is a long way. Now, there is actually... I'll just show you, folks. The staircase here, I'll just drive down it. Now, and I'll point out that my spinner handbrake around. The wall there, where you might be able to pick out the wing type pattern on the back of Planet Hype. There's actually a vehicle stuck in there in level 6, which is your secret vehicle, which I'll show you later in the video. Oh, damn it. Oh, they won't get me up here anyway. Once I get in here, because I, they can't get in here unless they jump. <laughs> Suckers. Oh yes, and I'll do a video. Part of those missions when I do that, there'll be a race. Now, boing! Because you come into the front of the vehicle. Oh, the boat. And this is what I didn't explain in the video. Now, you park your vehicle here. By these smaller steel crates. Jump up them. Turn your camera around. You don't, you don't want to if you're experienced. Jump up onto this crate. Run along the side of it, or dash if you wish. So when you come again, and there you go, folks. There's your night boat. It's actually one of my favorite vehicles of the game, too. And those things on the back, they actually are flames when you're driving. At least when you're reversing, anyways. Okay, so that's level three, the night boat. On to level four, and the hardest vehicle to control I found. It goes level four is Springfield Chopper. You know the deal. 
each level has their own. I'll do level ones when I get to level seven. When I've done the vehicle for that one, and that's one of the easiest vehicles to find too, level seven. Because excuse me, because you're not actually going too far from your starting location. Unlike some levels, but you know. And I'll do the level six shortcut a little later on as well when I do when I go to level the level three shortcut is the same as level six, so I'll touch on those then. Yeah, this one this is level four, folks. This is the same as level one. So the short I'm not gonna go into the other shortcut here because as I say it's the same as level one. And if you haven't noticed, I do have the jumping cars cheat on. To make this video nice and quick. I always have the invincible cars cheat, so Hey, it's not because I want to cheat, it's because it makes it easier for my videos, and it'll make it easier when I do a couple of missions, having to bash the vehicles to get items. Because as you hit vehicles, tr trees, car, you know, other pedestrians, even these trailers here in Royal King Trailer Park, you'll actually damage your vehicle, and then it will blow up. And I will show you what those vehicles look like when I put the exploding car sheet on for, for one of my other videos. Anyway, so you run, you come to the trailer park, down this end here, which if I, which if you, if you see the big sign over here, the key, that does change, and the toilet one in the background, and over there, in the in the corner, you actually have the house of Mo Sislak, the bartender. You actually get his sedan too, by the way. Uh, anyway, so here's your ATV in between the trailers. Hop on, and I'll sh I'll show you now what I mean. I'll just get out into the road. Get out in the rubber, I got a bit of space. Watch this. You're got your accelerator. Dang it! Okay, folks, that was level four. On to level five. This is level, uh, three foot chopper for level five. Now just think about <laughs> what's on that. That thing was a picture with Marge. That's just, that is just not quite right. Because there's this photo supplied by husband. <laughs> Homer, the fuck are you doing? Like, really, homie. The fuck are you doing, boy? Anyway, I should touch on this other shortcut that I didn't do last time. Uh, okay, let's go back this way, dude. We're heading to the Obliterator. Obliterator Tron, which is a monster truck, folks. You random object. What the? I can't believe that, folks. I just made a vehicle spin. Like, literally, it was doing a donut in place. I can get it. No! Oh, no! Shiva H. Vishnu! Or something like that, anyway. That was a paraphrase of Apu, by the way. I didn't quite get it right. There you go, there's your Obliteratatron. See? Jump up on the fountain. Or, if you wish, your parked car. And up. Yeah, I'll show you the shortcut. I'll just try the Obliteratatron to show you. So, you know, from level 2, where we started just over the other side of the town hall here. Whoa! This is very soft suspension, folks, being a monster truck. Now, here are level two where we started here. So, from here, for the shortcut to the other vehicle, and you can also go this way to, to, to this vehicle if you wish. This takes to the down. Oh, get out of my. Move your tons of gun vehicle. Okay, let's cut this right in front of most. So we're in the downtown section here, folks. So basically, this is the other section level two, which I didn't show before. So basically, you follow the follow the freeway, oh, highway, freeway, what motorway, whatever, whatever the whatever the fuck you want to call it, motorway, highway, freeway, all good. It's localization that re for that one, folks. But hold on. Boing! That's how you drop it down. Oh, what the? So that's how you drop it down in between two vehicles. Oh, uh oh. 
Oh, there you go. Well, you get to see the hit and run aspect of the game anyway. Now, there are a multitude of shortcuts you can take up here. Here's one of them. Whoa! Where did that guy come from? Basically, you go up here. And you do actually have to use the freeway for a uh, mission, mission too. Using Bart. Level 2. <laughs> and then you go... Here. Actually, that no, wasn't the downtown area. That was in... I can't think of the district there, but... Anyway. Probably a part of downtown. You come up here. And the monorail's up top there. Oh, up the top of this... So, so this central pillar here I just deliberately ran into. Well, it's not in this level because it doesn't hit it, so I'm driving it. But that, this one. Okay. Level 5. I'm at level 6, and I'm going to have to grab a vehicle here because this one's not anywhere near the start, folks. This is probably the hard... Well, the, this is probably the hardest to find. <laughs> and it goes to your level 6 Springfield Chopper. Don't want to see that picture on the lower left of it, though. I really don't know. Got me. Okay. I'll just grab the base vehicle for the level, which is the Ferini Red. Okay. I'm deliberately shortcut this one to get it to get to the place. So. Again, I'll do a video of the shortcuts. Later. But for now. Whoa! Damn it. Oh! Smacked in the log cutter. Basically, go down to the squid port. Now you actually see the car up to the top of the screen there. Where that wing pattern was. In level 2. Ah, uh, two, three, sorry. Level three. Hop out of the vehicle, hop out of the vehicular motor transport. Jump your way up. To about, yeah, about here. Oop, spin the car around, and there you have it, folks. Hans Mallman's pink Cadillac. Now watch this. No, you didn't do it. Let's see. Drive it, reverse out of the wall, and you're good to go. Mission select. Onto the level 7 Springfield Chopper. Oh dear. <laughs> Aliens. <laughs> brains. These levels are like brains. Anyway. <laughs> this is the shortest one of a lot of them. It's so easy to find, folks. Like, really, really easy to find. Oh, shut up, Homer. Basically, we just shortcut it all back over to the Quickie Mart. And park the car here by the damaged tanker. Jump up on the ladder up there. Up the side of the and I know what I did. I know what I didn't do. There's your secret vehicle, the RC. Here we go, folks. This is the level one sprinkler chopper, which I didn't show you earlier. And I will have to go back to level six now to touch on the uh, shortcut for that one in level three. Since I forgot. Just give this a moment, folks. But yeah, trust Homer just to butt him with hot dog eating contest. He'd butt him with any type of contest, too. and especially if it involved beer drinking, I think. But hey, that's Homer. But you've seen that now, we'll just duck off to. Level 6! Oh yeah! I'm so fucking good. Very well. At least that's what a few of my friends have said in the past. Re refer referencing themselves, obviously. Being a little arrogant, particularly one, or should I say, one in particular. 
But I still don't get what the fuck is over the picture in the bottom left of that fucking shopper. What the fuck? Grab a car. Attention cars! Ten year old hitchhiker needs a ride! Shut up, Bart. Okay, yeah, I'll show you from uh, I'll show you first from here. I'll show you to the car, we go this way. This one's a little more complex. Now you can go that way up across the top of the dam where the vehicles are coming from. Or you can go straight across the short the jump there. And we follow the road all the way. I can learn to drive the damn car. I should know how to drive by now. That's the worrying part. Sounds like one another car just spun too. Oops! Did a bit more of them. You got nudged by me. Thank God my invincible car is cheap. I say this road's a lot more complex than the other way. Well, if run vehicles off the road, we have to. <laughs> the hell did that armored truck get spun around? That's bullshit. Cut across the thing. Oof. You can go to the left there and follow the road down that way. Or you can go through the the brewery. If you got jump, you can go up over the sea spanker. I could, but I won't. Go this way. Here. Now, the first left I was talking about was here. This applies to both levels 3 and 6. Which brings you that choke up, brings you back. 2. Jump, you dumbass. Brings you back to. Ta da! Hans Man's Pink Cadillac. Well, there you have it, folks. Let me know in the comments down below if I have missed anything. And level 7 has no reverse aiming through the power plant too, by the way. They shut that off. He still has the very front where the car park is, but, you know, that's just part of the level. They shut the rest of that back part off from the, basically the back bridge. Where you jump over to the other rocket car, right back into the back of Burns Mansion, all that. That's being closed off. And including the back part of the plant as well, the Stonecutter's Tunnel, so. Outside of that, um... Yeah, let me know down below if, I, if there's anything that I may might have missed. If, if there's anything you might think I need to improve on. So, I shall have to look. Oh. Um, yeah, I'll leave you with that, folks. So, like, comment, subscribe, do your usual stuff you do down below. Um, uh, I might leave links to a couple of my other hit and run videos in the description. We'll see what happens uh, upon posting them. At the should I say at the time I post them and yeah, I'll leave you with I'll leave you with that folks. So this is band 073 smoking up them tires and burning that rubber on out of here. And that's me signing out folks. <laughs>